Do you have a license in multiple cities? Heck, multiple states? Well, I currently have my real estate license in Oregon, Washington, and soon to be Arizona. My primary real estate team is actually headquartered in Portland, Oregon. I work with teams all over the country, and I recently moved to Phoenix, Arizona. My business partner is licensed in Oregon, Idaho, and recently just moved to Houston, Texas. The crazy part, we only pay, each of us, we only pay one cap, one fee, and we're with the exact same company with all the same systems and tools everywhere. And this is one thing and one primary reason that we actually made the move to where we are. And if you wanna hear what the amazing benefits are to working inside of one company, having one system, one cap, working anywhere in the world and having access to the exact same stuff, stay tuned. Hey, what's up everyone? This is your host, Jesse Dow, coming to you with another episode of the Cloud-Based Brokerage. And if you wanna know everything from revenue share to real estate right here at eXp Realty, go ahead and smash that subscribe button and tap that little bell so you're notified each and every time I drop a new video. And honestly, I'm getting so many teams from real estate brokers, team leads, broker owners, influencer agents, and people not even in real estate. And I absolutely love it. So if you wanna get a hold of me, you have to give me a call, shoot me a text, send me an email, or even schedule a Zoom down in the description below. However you wanna get a hold of me, I got your back when making a move to eXp Realty. Well, some agents are licensed in multiple states and have to work at completely different brokerages because the brokerage that they're at doesn't even exist across the border. You might be on a border state. You might be in a border country. You might be in the US and Canada or US and Mexico and want to sell by, by country. And it was never in a, an actual thing until eXp came along. And the brokerage that I was at before being at exp was next home and before that it was actually um keller williams and because the broker or the market center was actually owned by two different people with kw i actually would have had to pay two whole completely different fees and two caps and it absolutely sucked and you know it wasn't even worth getting my license in another state because i was only doing a couple of transactions up in washington and oregon was with my primary business even with next home my broker owner thankfully owned the market center in Portland and in Vancouver. And guess what? I only had to pay one cap. It was nice, but there was other agents at the other Next Home franchise that didn't even hang their license with our franchise owner with Next Home because it would have been a whole secondary cap, a whole nother situation. So they actually would go up there and hang their license with zero cap brokers or 100% uh, brokers or even other companies that were cheaper just because they needed somewhere to hang their license. Inside of our own company, we couldn't even hang our license inside of our own franchise if they were two different people without them getting greedy. And that happens all over the world. You know, there's lots of agents that live in different cities that want to move or they have a secondary home and they live in say Michigan and they want to, they want to move to Florida and they have no way to, to how to do this and keep their business going. And, you know, I talk about being location independent all the time and really EXP is the only way that that allowed me to be in the position I am today, because before I even came to EXP, I felt that I was stuck in Portland. I felt if I ever moved away, my business would just flutter and I'd be absolutely sitting high and dry and I'd have to leave all that business behind me, which is what happens with almost 100% of real estate agents out there is they're, you know, they work their ass off to get to this position of, you know, retirement or the retired age and, you know, life happens. We just had COVID, so many people moved. You know what the number one occupation of people that didn't actually move were? Real estate agents and their businesses actually were thriving through COVID, but a lot of real estate agents actually wanted to leave. That's why with our YouTube business, we create people, we create systems so people can basically move markets, go wherever they're at, and it's gonna continue bringing in business. And then you can just refer those people off or you have an agent join you in your home market and they just start answering the phone and working with those clients is as easy as that. I've now done this in 11 markets. Like I said, I have my primary team up in Portland, Oregon. I live in Phoenix, Arizona. And with eXp Realty, I pay one cap and I'm licensed in multiple states. Yes, you do have to pay your association dues for each state, but I'm going to tell you right now with eXp paying one cap, it's $16,000. It's an 80-20 split. Once you hit that uh, $16,000 cap, you go to a $250 uh, transactional fee. But if you do 20 deals at that, you become what they call an icon agent and you get your 20 or your $16,000 back in stock. So the stock 
uh, was at $8 last year. And at its peak before it split, it was at 190. My stock portfolio was worth $300,000 before the split. And the crazy part was I didn't do anything special. I just did my job here at eXp. You know, you get stock by sponsoring agents and they sell their first home. You get stock when you sell your first home every year. That icon capping status uh, icon award. Also, when you uh, cap regularly, you get stock and then you can purchase stock at a 10% discount up to 5% of your commissions. And it's just an amazing benefit. And these are all added bonuses. Plus you get revenue share. So let's say you're in your market and you wanna move. Say you wanna move somewhere, say you wanna to move to Spain. We have EXP in Spain, France, Mexico, Brazil, Portugal, uh, coming up with Germany, Japan. We also have Hong Kong. I mean, 15 different countries, Canada, uh, the list goes on. We will be in 150 countries worldwide. But if you were at any EXP office in the world, guess what? You're going to have access to all the trainings, whether it's trainings in India, the US, Canada, it doesn't matter. You're going to have the exact same systems. You're going to have the same uh, programs. If you are outside of the US, you will have be using our IDX versus KV Core because KV Core only exists in the US. Um, but it's just this an amazing platform of collaboration and I love only having one system. And even if you are at KW or Remax, whatever it is, it's, it is, they all are similar systems, but your market center manager has the opportunity and you know, uh, to use whatever they want, you know, whether they're using Keller command at Keller Williams, who knows? There's still tons of agents that I talk to every single day that are still using Boomtown. Well, what happens if you left that Keller Williams and went to another Keller Williams that wasn't using Boomtown or you were, um, you know, they would retain that Boomtown account and you'd have to leave without all of your, your information. Here, you get KV Core, and guess what? If you move to another state, you stay at EXP, guess what? You still have access to all that information. And even if you leave EXP, they still let you take all of your, your leads that you bought with you. It's They give you 30 days, and you're even allowed to purchase KV Core and take it with you when you leave. It's probably the most transparent, agent-focused system on the entire planet. And they also offer healthcare. So now you're in, Minnesota, selling real estate, you're a part of the EXP healthcare program and you want to move to Florida. Guess what? You're going to stay inside of that healthcare network also. It isn't like you're out here trying to find different healthcares and things like that. And it's just a giant mess. I mean, never before until EXP came along, was there ever an agent focused real estate brokerage that ever existed? And the reason why is because every single brokerage is focused on the franchise owner, the market center manager. You know, people always come to me and say, Jesse, you know, we love what eXp is, you know, it's a system where you get seven levels of agent support. Those are your partners. Plus you get everything that eXp offers. You know, I came from a brokerage where it was basically just felt like my, my franchise owner was basically taking all my money and offering minimal support. And that's pretty much it. It's built directly for the franchise owner to be as profitable as possible. And typically here's, and it's no disrespect to these guys. They're all out there hustling, just like we are but they're in a different hustle position. I always say, is the brokerage levering you, leveraging you or are you leveraging the brokerage? Now, inside of 90% of the franchises out there, the franchise owner is still selling real estate. Now, that's your own competition. You're not only paying your broker owner a cap, but you're also paying him to compete with you. And if you're at 100% commission brokerage, I guarantee you, I've seen all the, all the models out there. I've done the math on all of them. Everyone is paying the, almost the exact same amount. If you're paying, if you are a high producing real estate agent, never in your life should you ever be at a 100% commission brokerage. That is the biggest rip off on the planet. If you're only selling one or two deals a year, then you should probably be not even in real estate. But when franchise owners are still selling real estate or even operating their own team, I think to myself, why would I ever want to be inside of that network? That's an absolute train wreck. That is, I'm a, I'm a real estate agent paying my franchise owner a cap, my money, and he's competing directly with me. You know, if any leads come into that center, they're not giving them to you. They might give you the crappy ones, but they're not giving you the good ones. They're giving them to their own teams. They're, giving, they're keeping them for themselves. I cannot understand in my life why a real estate brokerage does not have dedicated positions. And that's something that I, I was so furious with when I came into real estate. It wasn't until I actually got into eXp that I saw a system that actually has the overhead support with 500 full-time people working inside of the uh, back-end system, making sure that they have our back, making sure that we have brokers on hand that are actually here to support us. They're not out there producing, they're not out there attracting agents. No, they're here to make sure that our transactions go flawlessly 
And if you do need to make a move wherever you need to go, they're here to support the agent. Now, I don't know how a team leader, a broker owner, or a franchise owner can even say that they have all the support that their agents need because all of these guys are operating on the thinnest margins. They're spending all their time doing things that make money. But as you know, and as you get bigger, you probably are making less money as a team lead. And these are the dirtiest secrets out there is that franchise owners love teams because they make all the money. The team lead doesn't make any money. I saw this right when I first started my team is I noticed that I wasn't making any more money. And guess what? I was paying more in caps. My team, my broker owner was making more money, but I wasn't making any more money. And it absolutely made me angry. So I actually just froze the team. I stopped hiring agents. Then I found a model that actually made sense. I actually came to EXP so I could partner with agents all around the world because I was having agents call us every single day asking, how can we come and work with you? So I came to a model that actually empowered the agent to expand and also have the, the uh, ability to partner with agents in different cities, different states, different countries, all the way around the world. I just brought on an agent in Spain, actually three of them over there. It's absolutely mind blowing the position that you can put yourself in. And when you stop thinking locally, locally and start thinking globally, your entire net worth is going to grow. Your entire network is going to grow and you are going to feel the biggest restriction lifted off of you. I'm telling you right now, I have an agent that joined me. He said, dude, and he doesn't do YouTube. He doesn't do any of that stuff that we do. Just in, just a standard real estate agent. He said the minute that he left his franchise, his business has tripled and he has done nothing different. The franchise is built to restrict agents because the minute that you get too big, is the minute you leave. The minute you leave is the minute that you stop paying them a cap and they do not like that. Therefore, they're going to limit you. They're going to restrict you. They're going to hold you back and they're going to put you in a position where you, you feel like that you need them. And I'm going to tell you right now, there are better options out there. You just need to open your mind and open your idea to taking a look at what this offers. I'm telling you right now, I made this mistake for too long. It ended up costing me $4 million and people were approaching me the wrong way. Now, if they would approach me the right way, I would have made the move sooner. But I had all these people calling me saying, Jesse, you need to come over to EXP. You have so much to offer. You, uh, you're going to be able to retire. You're not ever going to have to sell real estate and this and that. And it's like, dude, I'm selling real estate at a high level. I love my team. I love my agents. I don't want to give this up. Well, guess what I've been able to do? I've been able to make them so much more money because now I let them all sell real estate. I don't, I practice what I preach. I don't sell real estate. I don't take the leads from my agents. I produce them 100% of their own deals. So if you want to get in this model, and you want to freaking take your business to the next level and partner up with true real estate practitioners that are generating hundreds of thousands of dollars in GCI and millions of dollars in GCI every single year, you got to give me a call, shoot me a text, send me an email, or even schedule a Zoom down in the description below because I know you want location independence just like I do. And until next time, I'll catch you on the next video.